Our top story today, South Korea is expected to see more than 400 new COVID-19 cases on Monday again. The seven-day average number of daily cases now stands at 416, which is within the range that could trigger a strengthening of social distancing measures. However, the greater Seoul region will keep its distancing measures at level two for now, but with some adjustments. Our Kim Yun Sing has the details. In response to South Korea's third wave of COVID-19 cases, Prime Minister Jung Se-kyun announced Sunday that stricter prevention measures will be taken in the capital region. For now, this whole area will keep its measures at level two officially. But from December 1st to the 7th, saunas and indoor sports facilities will have to close. Also, during that time, the government is shutting down amenities at apartment complexes, like cafes and study rooms, and is banning year-end parties at hotels and party rooms. Also, music academies and other facilities that teach wind instruments and singing will have to close, because mask wearing there is not feasible. The prime minister said, however, that all these measures will be useless unless the people themselves participate actively. We need to start a season two of K-quarantine, led not by the government alone, but with the people taking part together. We need not just compliance, but each and every person to follow the day-to-day -day prevention measures. The government has asked people in the capital region especially to cancel all end-of-the-year plans, especially if they involve 10 or more people. Outside the capital, the country will stay at level 1.5, but local administrations have the right to raise the level if they choose to. Kim Hyun-sung, Arirang News.